Hey, yo, they said it, not me. They said it, not me. Look, it's true. Your pee-pee's getting softer. At least for most men, it ain't getting hard no more. And I feel you. See, this is a natural occurrence. And it's mostly because of these six mistakes that are happening in your life. Today, your boy's going to help you out and ensure that your iron rod stays in iron. Let's hop into it. Number one, though, all jokes aside, let's cover averages. I, I, we need to get into what is actually realistic. So the base that we want to be at, or what we call what is supposed to be average penis size, is about 5.3 inches, which would be roughly around the size of a Snickers bar or the new iPhone 12, and not the mini. And I know for a fact that you boys have already grabbed your iPhone and probably sized up, or to something around the house if you don't have a ruler, but just for a rough estimate, that is about the average size of the male penis. So now that we know what's realistic and what's the average, yes, boys, my main goal is to keep you in the high end of those averages. Let's roll on to number two, weight gain. Look, your range of motion is severely cut, which makes the usable surface area of your penis a lot less. See, as you gain weight, your belly expands. The, the base of your penis is attached to your abdominal wall. So as your, as your belly expands, it pulls your penis inward, giving you less range of motion. Now, what's the good news? You lose weight, you get all those inches right back. Number three, stress and anxiety. See, Stress and anxiety elicit a response in your body where stress hormones are released, such as cortisol. Cortisol has basically like a seesaw effect with testosterone. See, the more cortisol you have in your body, the less testosterone you have in your body. The less testosterone, the lower your sex drive and the more limp your noodle is. See, but it doesn't always have to be that way. See, Blue Chew, our sponsor, makes it easy for you to literally chew it and do it. See, Blue Chew is a telehealth medicine platform that is revolutionizing the market by giving men chewable tablets that you can easily chew it and do it that will give you longer and harder erections. Now, here is the best part. It is a lot cheaper than Viagra and Cialis, even though it's made from the same active ingredients like sildenafil and tadalafil. And the cool thing with Blue Chew is that they come packaged in these individually packaged little envelopes where it allows you to carry it with you all day long and you can easily chew it. No need to swallow any pill. And, and the best part is that everything is done from the comfort of your home. Everything's done online. Once you submit your request, it's gonna be reviewed by a, by a professional medical provider. Look boys, the reality is that our peepees can get softer with all of life's ups and downs. But there is a way to get it hard when needed. See, I want you guys to click the link down below or go to Blue chew.com to get your confidence back. You just chew it and do it whenever you need. Number four, it's called disuse atrophy. In other words, or in simple terms, it's if you don't use it, you're gonna lose it. See, it's like any other muscle in the body. You need to use it frequently so it maintains its size. If not, you're gonna completely lose the size that you have on that muscle. Well, that type of atrophy works the same in your penis. So what you need to do is actually create blood flow down to that area and put it to use what it was made to do. R -r Responsibly, of course. But going too long without an er erection is not good for the penis because collagen, smooth muscles, elastin, and other tissues start decomposing, resulting in a loss of penile strength and girth. Number five, smoking. Look, smoking is already a bad, nasty habit that's bad for your health, but if that's not enough, it can further damage your guy downstairs by restricting blood flow. And what ends up happening is that no matter how stimulated you are up here, the blood flow just won't reach down there because of all the damaged blood vessels. And finally, number six, your testosterone is just dropping. See, lower testosterone levels can also lead to penis atrophy. This is exactly why it's important to live a balanced, healthy life where you're going to the gym, you're eating the right things, you're reducing your stress levels. See, all of this works together in boosting your testosterone. The higher your T levels are, the stronger and bigger and thicker your boy downstairs will be. Boys, that's it for today. Those are six mistakes that almost every dude is making that's destroying the man downstairs. So if you guys like this video and found it informative, don't forget to drop me a like down below. Also, don't forget to share this video. Yo, let's help our fellow brethren out. Let's make our generational average a little bit higher. That's it for me today. See you next time.